Hey, what's up guys? Kuroda here, back again with another tin opening, and today we will be finally opening the shiny Xerneas tin. So yeah, I finally got this in the mail today, and I can't wait to get this cracked open. And if you don't know about this, uh, I've been talking about it in the last few videos, and you should check them out if you haven't already. But this is uh, part of, uh, the, I think, the Legendary Shiny Collection. 10 set so out of this set you out of this 10 set you can get either one of these Pokemon's promos a regular 100% Zygarde uh, a shiny Evolto which has probably been the hardest one that, to find for me and a shiny Xerneas and today we'll be opening the Xerneas one and they each come with an, uh, an EX so let's just crack this open while I talk about this a little bit more. Uh, so yeah, you can get a EX out of here. And the only confusing part about this tin set is the fact that Zygarde is the only one that's not shiny. He's uh, he's in his 100% uh, form. And I know for a fact that there's a shiny Zygarde collection set. I, don't, I just don't know if it came before or after this. So it's very confusing. It would have been cooler to have just regular Zygarde as a promo. So, let me take this out and make sure I don't bend it. So, here it is. Uh, shiny Xerneas in its glory. It's pretty cool. I, I like the way it shines. Too bad it's not a full art or anything, but it still looks pretty nice. You can see it pretty good right there. But anyways, uh, let's see what packs we get out of this. We only get four. So let's see. We have one Steam Siege, one Fates Collide, and two Evolutions. So I'm going to get the worst out of the way and open up some Evolutions. We'll start out with uh, Raichu. Evolutions isn't like necessarily the worst set in the world. It's just uh, not the best. So we go one, two, three to the front. Let's see what we can get. Uh, so we have a revive. We have a slow bro spirit, slow bro spirit link, a super potion, an onyx, a magic carp, an energy, a star you. A Tangela. For our reverse, we have Arcanine. That's not too bad. And uh, just a Dugong. So, unfortunately, no Hollow. But an Arcanine is not too bad. But yeah, this. Uh, I've had some moderate luck with this set. Maybe we can pull something good. Let's just do one, two, three to the front. Yeah, I know y'all saw that, but it's fine. So we got a Metapod. A Charizard Spirit Link. That's the first one I've gotten from this set. Pretty pretty nice. Uh, a Double Energy. That's actually pretty cool. Uh, Vulpix. Fire Energy. A Voltorb. Charmander. Diglett. A Blastoise Spirit Link as our reverse. That's honestly pretty cool. I actually like that. And we have a Dugon <laughs> again. Oh, man, that, that just stains for some reason. So, unfortunately, no hollow out of those two packs. I guess we'll open up Fates Collide next. Maybe we can get a break. So we have one, two, three to the front. Maybe we'll get something good. Let's hope. Uh, maybe our luck will change and we'll actually get an EX or something. Or a GX. Uh, we have Dujin. A Kangaskhan. Pretty cool. Uh, Minchino. Deerling. Riolu. Jigglypuff. 
Carve Inc. Larvitar. <laughs> and we have a Larvitar for our reverse. That's pretty funny. And we have a we have a hollow. It's not bad. Uh Hollow Lucario. Has a uh, fight alone and vacuum wave. Not the best moves, but it's still a pretty decent card for being hollow. When I say it doesn't have the best moves, it's because I've been playing a lot of the online TCG game, and I can t I I'm getting used to how moves are and how effective they would be for me. So, yeah, yeah. Honestly, that's not it, it's not a bad card. It's just not the most effective card I would use in a deck. So. We got Steam Siege as our last pack, and let's see if we can pull something nice. So we do one, two, three to the front. I don't think you take off the energy. Uh, and let's see. We have Nidorino. Ambi Palm. I actually like this Pokemon. Uh, Pokemon Ranger. Remove all effects from attacks on each player in his or her Pokemon. That's pretty cool. We have Shellos. Krogon. Just looking off into the wind. Just thinking about how he's gonna sting Brock. Uh, we have T Tangela. Clink. Probably one of my least favorite Pokemon. Not bad, he's just not really my favorite. Uh, Joltik. I actually like this Pokemon. And we have Oshuot for our reverse. It's pretty cool. I like the way it shines right there. It's not like some of these other reverses that the main picture doesn't really shine with it that you can kind of see it when I do this it looks really nice and oh fortunately no hollow but we did at least pull one hollow from here and our reverses really aren't that bad either I'm actually pretty excited from what I got from uh, evolutions even though they're just reverses I'm like Arcanine's pretty cool like I have this as a hollow I think like from the original set, not Evolution. And the Spirit Link's pretty cool, and Lucario's not a bad Pokemon to pull. At least he's one of the fan favorite Pokemon. But yeah, that was my opening of the 2017 or 2018 uh, Xerneas 10 opening. I hope you did enjoy. Like I've been saying in the more, more recent videos is uh, I want to complete opening this uh, t these 10 sets by getting Evolto. And I've been trying, and I will find, I think I, I've, I've kept on seeing it online for sale, and then they sell out for some reason. Maybe because Evolto is like one of the best of the three, next to Xerneas. I mean, not Xerneas, uh, Zygarde. Or something like that, I don't know why they keep eluding me. But hopefully I will be able to find it. But if you did enjoy, remember to hit the like button. Give me a subscribe if you did like it too. And if you have a suggestion for any kind of set or that that's uh, related to Pokemon, just let me da know down below. I will I will be happy to open that set. I have some ideas for some really cool openings and uh, that I think you will enjoy. So just subscribe to see what and see and look forward to what I have in the future. And if, if you have the suggestion, just let me know. It could be Yu-Gi-Oh! Pokemon any kind of card game that's kind of related. I'm not really that picky. I've been thinking about doing some U uh, more Yu-Gi-Oh and some chaotic openings. So yeah, if you, uh, hit, uh, I'm repeating myself again. Hit that like button down below and I will see you guys in the next video. <laughs> Bye guys.